game this continue last example we're going to show you how to uh, program the trading rules in Excel and, and, and test the profitability of the trading rules so we calculate the moving average both of them and we start from the day so to easy the navigation let's frozen the pen um, will freeze 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 yeah then we can see clearly the date and the title of it okay so now we want to say the signal um, so we will say if this is smaller than that uh, to save time I just did the um, formula to when and turn off the recording but let me explain what this um, formula means um, it actually have two set of condition the first one is say if the short term is larger than the long term today but yesterday it's opposite then which means we know it's crossing upward then we say we're gonna buy so the signal is one otherwise we do another check to see with whether if this one today actually is smaller than yesterday but uh, sorry the, the short term is smaller than the long term but yesterday the short term actually is larger than long term so it's, it's crossed downward then we're gonna it's a sell signal so we would do minus one otherwise we put a zero so that's and then we copy and paste it through the whole line we can see there's something generating there one way of look, make things easier to 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 spot uh, when you reading it is doing the um, formatting uh, conditional formatting here um, where is the conditional formatting here um, we say um, if it's greater than zero then do something yeah if it's less than zero then it do less than zero let's say do red and greater than zero we do green then we can see um, red green red green and those are the buy sell signals and then we need to generate another uh, signals which are actually telling us the holding of, of our strategies because from the sell the selling indicator then we, we will always short this security for the whole rest of the period until there's a green come in so I'd write th this um, simple uh, formula saying if this one actually is equal to zero then we take the one same as the previous one otherwise we will just take the current ones replace um, if we copy the, f the conditional formatting then it will show more clearly so this period we we actually short this period with long the security then we can calculate the, the return during this period so this period the peer, current period's return will be this times whatever return we can generate during that period and then we can sum it to, to show the whole strategy uh, returns to the end and okay we can s just do a sum of it if we do a simple analysis of uh, the data we can show that actually there is some um, positive return during the period you can see from this basic statistic we can tell that actually in total